Hello, and welcome to this video of Odoo Tips and Tricks. Today we're going to talk about filtering and modifying a filter once it's already been set up. So uh, let's get started. I'm going to go into the Sales app. <clears throat> Here on the quotation screen, you'll see that there is already a filter set up when I click in uh, for my quotations. Now if I want to see what uh, rules this filter is using or change them, I can hover over this filter and then you'll see that the filter icon or the funnel icon turns into a gear. So if I click directly on that gear, now I see the modify condition pop up and I can see the rules that are being applied. So here we just have one rule, the salesperson equals the user ID, my user ID. So that means that any um, sales order or quotation in this case that matches my user ID is going to show up on the screen. Now if I wanted to add a rule to this, I could do so in several ways. I could come over here and click this plus icon. I could also add a branch or a, a conditional rule that depends on this rule having been satisfied in order to work. I could also delete this rule and start a new one if I wanted to um, make a completely new filter. I'm just going to go down here and click new rule. I'm going to uh, make sure to match all of the following rules. My two options are to match all or any. I want both of the rules to be matched at the same time as opposed to Odoo giving me any result that um, satisfies either one of these conditions. So I'm going to leave this set to all and then I'm going to say I would like only to see um, documents where the status is not, that's what that exclamation mark means, is not canceled. I also am going to add a new rule that says the creation date is within the past, uh, within the last month, so the last negative one month. Okay, so with my three rules here, I'm going to click confirm. You can see all three of my rules are up here. And now I'm going to save this filter as a favorite so that whenever I open quotations, this is what I see automatically. So I'll say my open quotations last month. I can make this my default filter upon opening the sales app and going to the quotations view. And I can also share this with other people by checking this box. I'm going to leave these uh, both unchecked. I'll just save this in case I want to see it. So now I click Save, and you can see that this is now a favorite view. If I leave the Sales app, come back in. Uh, the first filter is just my quotation still, but now I have this favorite available to me. Uh, however, I can still modify this favorite just like any other filter. So if I hover over it, the star there becomes a gear can click on that and see the three rules that I just set up. If I wanted to get rid of the uh, creation date rule, I can come over here and click on this garbage bin, click confirm. And now you see Odoo doesn't delete or change the actual favorite. It just shows me the two rules that are left. I can now make another favorite that just says my open quotations make this my default filter, click save, and now you have another one. So that's one easy way to um, copy and modify your existing uh, favorites and views to uh, get another copy and um, see what the rules are in place um, in any of your existing favorites. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions at all, please don't hesitate to contact us uh, with the links down below. Thanks. Bye.